You know what's great? The EQV does not only help you save energy, it also helps you regain it to your battery. Let me explain how that works. First, recuperation. It means that the EQV converts kinetic energy into electricity when decelerating and regains that back to the battery. And to do so most efficiently, the EQV offers one automatic and four manual recuperation levels. With the four manual recuperation levels, you can decide between no recuperation, which is called sailing, up to a very strong recuperation. The most efficient and convenient way of recuperating is using the D-Auto function. In D-Auto, the EQV recuperates dynamically and predictively according to the data provided by safety assists, by the camera and navigation. Let's say the car in front of you is slowing down. The EQV will adapt recuperation and therefore speed automatically and accordingly. And all you need to do is remove your foot from the accelerating pedal. How cool is that? Have you guys ever asked yourselves how to choose between maximum comfort and maximum range in an electric vehicle? Well, the EQV has four answers to that and those are the driving modes. Now, in the standard C setting, you have full power and full torque and that paired with high heating and air conditioning performance. Driving mode E, which I like to call the in-between setting, balances all parameters perfectly. It gives you good climatization and power output, but always keeping an eye on consumption. With the E plus driving mode, you get the maximum range. To achieve that, power output and torque are reasonably lowered, heating and air conditioning are also reduced. The S driving mode, the S stands for sport, places the emphasis on the best responsiveness for a spontaneous sporty driving performance. All right, I hope that helped you get all ready and set for some fun driving that is comfortable and efficient at the same time.